Good afternoon. We're back with more Marvel Champions. Today will be Wolverine versus Spiral on expert difficulty. Spiral is a very unique scenario. She can't be damaged while on this escaped side. You have to get her to cornered. In order to get her to cornered, it requires you to reveal one of these cards from the alternate deck. In order to do that, we have to remove threat from this side quest. And we've got the three cards in there. If the if a card that is an environment instead of the card that we want comes out, then we place this card on the bottom of the deck and cycle in the new card so eventually we'll get to the right one. But until then, Spiral can't be attacked, can't take damage or be stunned, threat can't be removed from the main scheme, and instead of her attacking, she schemes. Let's go ahead and drop Logan's Cabin for the Mulligan. So we'll flip to Wolverine's side and we'll go ahead and go One, two, three, four for Storm. That's not the first thing I want to do. We'll go one, two for Track by Scent. Move three threat and draw two cards. After the last threat is removed from here, the player who removed that threat reveals the top card of the show deck and places three threat here. So we got the show deck shuffled, and let's see what the top card is. It is the Mojo Files. Game of Mojos gives plus one hand size, so I should have drawn one extra card, but I didn't. Each minion gains quick strike. Each ally takes minus one consequential damage. We'll go ahead and use a second track by scent. Draw two cards. Reveal another card from the show deck. It's the wrong one again. Each other encounter card gains in sight plus one. Each friendly character gets plus one thwart. This time we'll go ahead and remove three threat by taking two damage. And there we have the right card, cornered. Flip Spiral to her corner side. This will cause her when revealed, if any, to resolve. There is no when revealed. And then we have reveal the top card of the show deck. which will place this card back in the show deck and cornered and then shuffle. So we've got a game of mojos back. Three threat back on the search for spiral and spiral can now be damaged. So we're gonna use Wolverine's claws for a lunging strike for eight damage. We'll use the, we'll use storm to get out clarity of purpose We'll use Wolverine to deal two damage, and then we'll draw five. One extra thanks to a game of mojos. So, one threat, one attack from Spiral. I think we'll need Wolverine to defend. If, if I don't defend with him, he could die if the boost is three. Put this card into play, okay. Player order, each player may search their deck for a card and play that card for free. It's a side quest, a fetch quest, but it's got no downside, so I don't really know why I would need to deal with it. Anyway, two damage to two defense, no effect, and then we got 
a teleport counter and one encounter card. Um, exhaust your identity anyway, so that surges into two more encounter cards. The villain schemes for one, two, three, four. And the villain attacks you for one, two, three. Ouch. Alrighty. So Wolverine heals for two. And we can go. Plunging Strike to put Spiral into Phase 3. When revealed, Spiral attacks each player in order. Probably need to play an X-Men then before I do that. Go 1, 2, and 3 for the Professor. Get a Confuse on Spiral. And Thwart for 3 and then do the lunging strike. Wait, no. Professor can't thwart for three. Need him to defend the attack. So then we can do the lunging strike. Attack. And another teleport counter. And then we'll flip to alter ego. Or else I'm gonna die and we'll draw up to the hand size. Plus one for a game of mojos. So, one threat, remove confuse, no activation means no teleport counter, and then one encounter card is the villain schemes. Well, that's gonna be the activation, so scheme for four. And then spiral's going to flip and remove the teleport counters. So we need to once again find the cornered card in order to flip her back and then we're going to have 17 damage to do. We could lose pretty quickly because we can't remove threat from the main scheme. So let's heal. Let's flip. We'll go with to me my X-Men. and grab probably Pixie, could be Gentle. Let's grab Pixie. Just put the To Me My X-Men out there to remind me. And let's go with let's remove two health to remove three threat. See if we can find the right card. The Mojo Files. Not the right one. Let's try again. There it is. Flip her back. She gets an immediate attack. And then we need another Mojo card. Dial M for Mojo. Well, so she starts with one teleport counter because of that attack. Can't use Slice and Dice, I don't have the HP for it. I can go Jubilee, deal three damage. Actually, I'd like to keep that slice and dice, and we'll spend the Uncanny X-Men, then we'll draw three. Need Jubilee out there to defend an attack, so one threat, one attack, and then one encounter card, which is Master Plan. That's a lot of threat. Six, twelve, well, I have enough damage if I had enough resources to pay for everything. Let's see. Wolverine regenerates two, so I need 14. We can go 
One, two, three, one, two, three. Yeah, we got enough. One, two, three for slice and dice number two. And then Wolverine's final attack takes care of Spiral. Not an easy villain, but Wolverine does particularly well against her. In fact, Wolverine does particularly well against... I forgot about the Insight one on the Encounter card. That should be plus one threat. Wolverine does particularly well against all of the Mojo Mania scenarios. And Wolverine's a lot of fun to play. I like this Uncanny X-Men deck with Wolverine with, to me, my X-Men. He's also pretty good with Aggression. And he's fun to play with Aggression, but... I think, on average, the leadership deck is his best deck. That's typically the case with most heroes. If they're not good with protection, then leadership is their best aspect. But in certain scenarios, aggression is the way to go. Anyway, thank you for watching.